ஹாய் எவ்ரி ஒன் வெல்கம் பேக் டு மை சேனல் ஹோப் யூ ஆல் ஆர் டூயிங் குட் ஸோ ஃபைனலி த டே ஹேஸ் கம் வி ஆல் ஹவ் பேக்ட் அண்ட் வெல் செட் டு கோ டு ஏர்போர்ட் வி ஆர் லீவிங் டு யூஏ அண்ட் வித் அ ஹெவி ஹார்ட் வி மேனேஜ் டு கிளிக் அ ஸ்மைலிங் செல்ஃபி டு சென்ட் டு அவர் பேரண்ட்ஸ் That's my treasure which my husband is carrying so carefully. It's all my clay pots and jars. We reached early morning by 7 o'clock uh, at Sharjah International Airport and our brother-in-law was there to pick us. I couldn't make a video on that because we all were tired and we couldn't sleep well. So after having a short nap, I just started cleaning my plants. they are the ones who were left out without life i was really shocked to see that two of my plants were completely dead since we arrived on saturday and sunday was a working day for me so i had to make my flat back to home within the day i planned to start with the kitchen so i gave a quick clean to everything in the kitchen A bag full of bakery items is smiling there at me just to increase my weight. Now let me show you what all I have purchased from India. I brought a 5 liter medium steel cooker. I had been looking for this inner closure type one because this is more safer than the other type. And here comes a ceramic jar. This is like the real traditional one which we can put uh, salted mangoes and all. and this is a traditional clay pot actually this one can be used only to make a special appam which we call otada or mutta patri this can be made in the traditional way only in this pot so i i really love it so i made bought that and this is another one which this shape attracted me so i got that My ever time favorite sweet is unniyappam so I didn't miss the chance to get a steel pan for it. Here in Lulu we are getting non-stick one. I am completely avoiding non-stick pans. And obviously the unavoidable fresh coconut oil. Here goes few steel utensils which I got uh, from a sh- small shop in Alappi. They are the it is a stainer actually here we are, what we are getting is uh, really not strong so i got that and the idiyappam maker if you are using these kinds of idiyappam maker i will tell you always make sure to leave these two lines while you are pressing it if you completely press it it will for sure it will break and steel lunch box for kids and these i got just to keep all the hot pots they are also made of stainless steel and it's actually good to keep all these kind of clay pots it will set very well and these little cute ceramic jars also i got i thought of keeping salt and sugar in them actually i bought these kind of ceramic jars clay pots everything from a street vendor in alappi we got it for really reasonable price and it is it, it was really good if you are buying these kind of steel water bottles always make sure to have this kind of large washers in it or else it will leak very soon it is not a kind of flask it is just a stainless steel water bottle they are also having very reasonable price in india because it i i had checked here in lulu and all it's very costly here So that's all what I bought for my kitchen. Actually we were in a hurry so I couldn't do an extensive shopping. Here comes the home grown garcinia. It's my sister-in-law's gift actually. She reserves it every year for me. I felt it's really nice and better than what we buy from the shops. Half of this piece only enough for a very uh, good fish curry. So here I'm removing all these uh, junk parts of it after cleaning the kitchen i went on to clean the fridge fridge is all empty so i'm just giving a quick clean and thought to 
keep everything back in place. First, I thought to keep all the medicines which we have carried and brought from India in place because in any case of emergency, they should be handy. Then I moved each of the bags accordingly to the rooms. Then it will be easy to unload them. Then I moved on to clean all the shoes which we carried. Cleaning sport shoes, an easy way I will tell you, you can use a quick wash in your washing machine and then just rinse it off empty. Kids are arranging their things back to their room. Back from vacations are really a declutter time to me because I do most of my shoppings in India. So when I'm back, I will have enough things to donate or dispose. Now this is how my room looks like. Now I have to start with it. Eyeliners from Color Essence are my favorite. These safety pins and hair pins I will never miss to get from India. Also here goes my Itex Kajal and few earrings I got from India. Please don't misunderstand that this is a promotion of Himalaya products as I have told in my previous video that I am a great fan of Himalaya products. So I will grab as much as I can when I am in India because whatever Himalaya is an Indian product and also we can get them at a very good and reasonable price from India. Basing on the expiry dates I grabbed few of the face washes, face pack and scrubs. Under eye creams actually I got for 190 rupees from India. And a bottle of fresh lemongrass oil. I got it from Kodai Canal. Now I have arranged everything back in place. I am not showing all in detail because my cupboard organization is already done there. As I told I always do my dress shopping from India. So if you are interested to see them do let me know in the comment section so that I could do a separate video in that. My motto is to pay less, get more and stay style. These all are my stall collections. And that's a small bag left out to donate. All the accessories and cosmetics, everything are back in place. Since the very next day I had to join back to my duty, we thought to get help from a brother to clean the house. As you all can see, he has done his job very well thanks to him. I really don't want to stress out myself because I was sure that another bunch of stress is waiting out there at my office desk. Felt really happy and refreshed as my flat has turned back to our happy home. An organized home always gives you a disciplined life and a disciplined life is necessary to lead you to the success. As you keep a home to stay, Always make sure to give a home to all of your things as well. A clean kitchen is the basis of a healthy family. While he was cleaning, I made the salted mangoes to keep in my jars. So they filled there. It will take at least a month to get it done. So that's all for today's video. I hope you all liked my video. If so, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and stay tuned.